some cool cases and accessories from Taurus up next. <laughs> Welcome and thanks for watching. If you could do me a huge favor, hit the subscribe button, tap the bell to get notified when I post new content, and give this video a thumbs up, I'd very much appreciate it. So every new iPhone release season, I like to take a look at the cases and accessories that are available for the newest iPhones. And every year I've done this, I believe that I've always had a Taurus case of the bunch. Uh, this video is gonna be no different, except I'm gonna focus solely on Taurus's available line for the iPhone 12 Pro Max. And I'd like to thank the fine folks over at Taurus for sending over these cases for me to review. And as a bonus, they also sent me over a couple of uh, related accessories. So let's go and get started, and let's start by checking out their new cases. So this first case we're gonna take a look at is the Tour Slim Fit, and this is the Space Black. And let's set aside their packaging. Let's start a wonderful journey. And this is the case. And this is, looks to be a, or this feels to be a rigid case. And here is the Slim Fit uh, Space Black case. It has uh, Tours branding on the inside, but that seems to be the extent of the branding. There's no branding at all on the outside. There's some openings for the uh, speakers and lightning cable, power button, up and down, volume control, opening for the mute switch. And again, this is a rigid case. And since, it's a more, since it is a more rigid case, there are some slots here so that it's easier to take the phone in and out of this case. So we're going to put the phone in here. I have, again, the Graphite 12 Pro Max. Actually fits in pretty well. And these slots here on the corners do make that an easier process. And that's a nice, sleek kind of case. And this is definitely a slim case. If you wanted a case that was just form-fitting to the phone, I think this would be it. Again, it's a rigid case. The outside feels smooth, but it's not, I wouldn't call it slippery. Buttons are really clicky. Again, there's the openings for the ports and speakers. Um, and easy access to the mute switched. Actually, let me take a look. There really isn't much of a lip. But then again, I have a screen protector on here. There is a nice size bezel there for the uh, cameras, as you can see. And so the cameras are well protected. I'm not so sure about that screen though, because there doesn't seem to be, right? Well, if I didn't have a screen protector, that would probably uh, give you some protection, but my screen protector, which is a thin one, I think is touching the, uh, will touch the table. It looks like it's slipping out of the case too. Not sure if that is an issue with maybe like manufacturing variants, but it seems to be popping out of the case. But it is a slim case. It seems to fit this black iPhone well. So again, there are some issues. You can maybe see that corner popping out again. And it doesn't want to stay in there. So again, I'm not sure if that's maybe a variance in manufacturing, maybe a, a problem with this specific sample of the case. Um, but yeah, I'm not really comfortable with that kind of popping out of the case. And the bottom is really even. The fit on this one, again, this is a slim case from Taurus, is not, I'm gonna say is not very good. At least this sample of this case. But it is a, it's a good looking case and you would, should get um, some drop protection from it because it is a more rigid case. So I was gonna take this one off and move to the next one.
All right, next case we have, this is the shock proof uh, for the iPhone 12 Pro Max. And this is the black. We have the case. Let's set these aside a little bit. And these look like buttons. If you have different color buttons, that's actually kind of cool, I think. And again, let's start a wonderful journey. Curious to see how these buttons work. Never seen that in a case before. Let's take a look at the case itself. Again, this is the black. And it's a, a darker case. Looks like there's a TPU bumper and a frosted clear back. And this should really work well with the graphite phone. It's a cool looking case. And that's a slick looking case actually, and it feels really good in the hand, I'll say. There are the power buttons, up and down volume, easy access to the uh, mute switch. Nice raised lip for the front of the screen and a pretty generous rear bezel for the cameras. So you will be protected whether you put your phone face down or on its back. And there are the port openings for the lightning cable and the speakers and there is a little bit of branding there on the side it says Taurus and you can't really capture that frosted back on a black phone but it's very subtle it's really a nice feeling good looking case I like this one And let's see how these buttons work. I'm really curious to see how these things work. So we have red and yellow. Let's see. I'll try one set of these on here. Let's, let's try the yellow. And here's the back. It says disassemble and installation. Nope, do not install it backwards. Let's go ahead and open these up. Because I think this is actually kind of cool. Let's see what these look like on here. Drop these out. Don't want to lose one. They are pretty small. Little like skinny Tic Tacs. Let's go ahead and take off the case so we can fit these little buttons on there. I guess we can just push these out. Just remove these from the inside just by pushing out there. And let's go ahead and see if I can remove the black power button. There it goes. Comes right out. Don't want to lose those. And the up and down volume buttons. I'm going to replace them with these yellow ones. Just pushing them in. There it is, there's a black with the yellow buttons. It's kind of cool, let's put the phone back in here. That's a cool looking case. It's kind of fun to play with and I wonder if they will. They plan on having um, more button colors in the future. Or maybe offering them separate. I wouldn't mind having some blue buttons on there. I think that look kind of cool. But yeah. It's a fun little case with customizable buttons. You have a choice again of the black buttons that it comes with, or the yellow or the red. Place those buttons there. Again, these are the red buttons. I won't be putting these on, but they do come with red. I think the yellow looks cool. 
Cool case. That's good. And it, there is some protection there. I want to mention that there is going to be moderate drop protection. And again, you'll be protected with the phone screen down or on its back. Let's move along. I like this case. And next we have the clear case. And actually let's go with this one first. This is the crystal clear case. And I looked at a few uh, clear cases, if you're interested in clear cases, in a clear case video. And I'll go ahead and link that somewhere over here, up here, and in the description below if you want to take a look at those clear cases that I took a look at this year. Start a wonderful journey. And this is their, I believe their crystal clear case. It's a very flexible TPU. This is a smooth surface. Um, I wouldn't call it slippery. There is some tackiness there. So this should be um, easy to remove from your pocket, uh, but not slippery. It shouldn't slip out of your hands because there is some, some grip and tackiness there. If you take a look, there is a micro dot texture. I don't know if the capture is going to be able to, to capture that, but there's a micro dot texture on the back and as well as the sides and that will prevent the kind of rainbow or wet effect from it touching your phone and there seems to be some extra like extra air pocket there in the corners let's go ahead and put this on the phone fits really easy and this is actually a really nice clear case there is it seems to be from my eye it looks like there is a hint a very light hint of like a light blue to this case and that could be an aid to help prevent yellowing since this this is a tpu case there is a good size lip to protect the front display the screen and a generous bezel around the cameras for this one as well so you're protected whether you put the phone face down or on its back. This is a really nice clear case. I really do like this clear case. And you should have moderate drop protection. On the corners, again, there's an extra bit of an air bubble there. I don't know if the camera again can see that, but it's there. And then openings for the lightning and speaker ports. It's a nice clear case. If you're looking for a clear case, this is actually a pretty nice one. Very minimal. Um, looking for branding, and I don't really see any branding. Just a micro dot texture. So nice, nice clear case from Taurus. And let's take a look at the final case. And this one is also a clear case, I believe called the Moon Climber. And this is a cool case because it's clear, but it also features a stand. And I always like having a case with a stand. Simple but unique. And you know, I will say these cases actually, they hold up to their, their tagline. They are simple and definitely unique, especially in the case of this uh, shockproof case. So again, another clear case. Another clear case, this one has a stand, which I always like having these. I'm gonna remove the clear back. There's not one on the bottom. And let's put the phone in here. That's a nice case. That's a good fit on there. Fits just as well as this clear case. Yeah check something take it out really quick check the rigidity so this is seems to be again a more rigid back so this is probably a polycarbonate back and TPU bumper sides put the phone back in there again really quick just wanted to check the rigidity of that because as we can see in this one is all TPU this is not rigid on the back at all it's very flexible a lot of flex in that case 
So that's a good looking case. Buttons for the power. For the power. Um, up and down volume. Easy to access. Mute switch. Openings for the uh, lightning and speakers. And there is a micro dot texture along the bumper, but the back is clear. And here it also features a stand. So that's kind of cool. I really like having a stand. Um, there is ample lip on the front to protect the front of the phone. And this one actually has raised corners. So the corners are raised each corner. There is a bit of a air pocket there and there is a generous bezel around the cameras. So you'll be protected whether your phone is screened down or on its back. And this is, this is a good looking case. I really do like this case. This is the moon climber. And it also has, as extra bonus, a stand. So you open up the stand that way. It feels like it's mostly friction and you can stand your phone up like that and use your phone here if you wanted to or place it horizontally so that you can watch movies especially when you're traveling that's a really cool case i like this case and this is again the moon climber from taurus so as well as cases, Taurus also sent over a couple of accessories. And one is a earphone case, and this one happens to be for the, um, the AirPods Pro. That's why I have my AirPods Pro here. And these are the Taurus AirPods Pro case, and this one, it says, is in midnight green. And here's the case. And we just put the case on the case, or should be have the opening where the hinges are, so that it opens. There, that looks correct. And the light shines through on there. And these are for the AirPods Pro, and that's cool. A nice, fun color. Here. And these are for the AirPods Pro. So that is a fun case, protective case for your AirPods. And the next thing we have is the Taurus wireless charger. And let me go ahead and open this. Wireless charger, play while charging, magnetic automatic positioning, and fast wireless charging. So this is gonna be like their magnetic MagSafe charger. Magic, magic plate. The magic plate will not interfere with wireless charging and mount easily. Sticks on the back of devices for mounting. charger. It looks to be USB-C. It's a pretty long cable on there. I can see that already. And here's their plate. And you could stick this, I believe, on the back of cases so that you can have uh, positioning for the magnets so that you know that the, uh, the charger will always be in the best position for charging and some literature. But if you happen to have an iPhone 12 Pro Max, this should stick on the back of the phone like a MagSafe charger and it does. It sticks there right away. And it's a pretty strong magnet as you can see, it's holding the weight of my iPhone. So this is their version of the MagSafe. Let's go ahead and 
try this out really quick. Again, that's a pretty generous cord they give you. And it doesn't, it does not come with a charging brick. So I happen to actually have my anchor here and my anchor is USB-C. Go ahead and plug that in there. I'm going to plug this to the outlet. So it's going to try the phone on here and it's charging. As you can see, confirmation is charging and it is a magnetic charger that's compatible with MagSafe. So that's actually a cool looking charge, just rounded edges. Um, it will lay flat somewhat. And Taurus is saying that this will also deliver 15 watts of fast charging, just like the MagSafe charger. And it functions quite a bit like the MagSafe charger. So if you're looking for an alternative, Taurus has you covered. Let's see if this works with their cases. I'll grab the shockproof case because that's the one that I like. I like all of them. This one I think is kind of neat though. Let's see how strong that magnet is. And yeah, it is showing as charging and that's through their shockproof case. So the magnet is strong enough. I, I would believe um, just like a MagSafe charger, it'll work with most cases as long as the back is not too thick. Now I'm curious to see if this one will work because there is a kickstand there. Let's see if their charger will work with their moon climber case with the stand. Yes. And it looks like it does work with their moon climber case. Despite, despite there being a metal stand there. And you can see it come up and start charging. Let's go ahead and see if we can hear that now that the mute switch is off. And there, confirmation is charging and again, charging with their case with the stand. So those are some cool cases and accessories from Taurus. I like these uh, AirPods Pro cases are a really nice touch and I'm sure they have different colors. And these are all, again, great accessories. I really like kind of the uniqueness of this shockproof case and the color buttons. I'll probably be swapping those buttons out a few times while using this case. And a nice, really, really nice clear case that will show off the great design of your phone. And a nice functional case with a kickstand or stand so that you can um, watch movies or use your phone one-handed while you're eating or whatever you may be doing or at the desk and a slim fit case in space black this one was a little iffy again the fit wasn't the best but that could be a variance in the manufacturing of this case um, I'll have to see if Taurus uh, has any feedback about that I'll have to ask them exactly what's going on with this because the fit really wasn't the best for this I really wouldn't recommend this case um, but these other three easy recommendation so what did you think of these Taurus cases and accessories? Uh, did you find a favorite here? Is there something here you think you might pick up? Or do you have another favorite from Taurus that you've used in the past? Let me know in the description below. And until the next one, please take care and be safe out there.